morning, niggas. Good morning, niggas. It's your boy, Unk No Punk. Unk No Punk, with another short one just for you. Happy Wake and Bake, fam. Happy Wake and Bake, first off. This short is going to be about um Andre Young's bum daughter, Dr. Dre's daughter, Latanya Young. She has now a GoFundMe page with the um the limit set to 50000 then she's asking for 50000 trying to get a stable home for her and her children, right? She says now she's living out of a rented SUV, right? A rented SUV, fam. Now, if you rent an SUV, that shit going to cost about monthly, at least about $2,000 minimum. I would say shit, more than that, definitely, two, three thousand 3000 minimum. So with her renting an SUV, because took that money, got a little small apartment or something there, no two bedroom or something like that. Put the kids in there, huh? No, she ain't do that. She says no. Um, the kids are not living inside the SUV. They at friends' house, and she's the only one that's sleeping inside the SUV. Like who gonna believe some stupid shit like that? Like she ain't got no boyfriends or girlfriends. Email they, they can say, come on in here, or even a family member, some fucking body, right? But the, the crazy shit about it, she says that um, Dr. Dre's ex-wife is getting, I think. Two hundred thirty thousand a month. And she has the nerve to say that her mother should be getting two thousand three hundred. Nah, put like this in. This is a long time ago. Dre was no billionaire then, making all this big, big money. He had money then, but he wasn't like the way he is now. So therefore, how can her mother get this this certain amount of money? I don't know if they was married or not. They was whatever, whatever, whatever. But hey, this dude done gave you allowance. For 37 years. Now she has nothing at all. Nothing to show for. She didn't go to school. She probably had a fucking dropout. Didn't go to the college. I'm sure if she's Dre's daughter, he, she was like, oh, daddy, I'm going to go to college. He would pay for the goddamn college. I'm sure. But she's a goddamn, how you say it on She's lazy. She's there. She's, she's lazy. That's the fuck she is. Having all these four kids and where the daddy's at. And like I said before, I bet there's more than one goddamn Father to these kids. They probably looking like goddamn Puerto Rican, Chinese, black, whatever goddamn thing these kids did. But now she's running a GoFundMe page for 50 G's. Hmm. We know goddamn with people. They're gonna, some people are going to send some money in. I'm not saying do not send a girl no money. But I'm saying it's, it's going to go above the 50,000. When I say that, I say because the George Floyd family, they asked for, from get buried, they asked for think, 1.5 million. That was the initial. Start up. 1.5 million they wanted to bury George Floyd. And I questioned that. I said, who the fuck needs 1.5 million to get buried? Huh? You see they put George Floyd in that big gold casket in front of that big stadium, that um, thing, but they didn't open that shit up. He probably wasn't even in that goddamn thing. 1.5 billion just for burial. And then they, they didn't stop once they got the 1.5 billion. The shit went to about 13, 14 million dollars. Hmm? So they cashed out big time without the damn settlement. You know what I'm saying? So what you gonna have a Dr. Dre's um daughter? No, 50 G's. It's not much money. It's not much. What you gonna do with 50 G's? Get an apartment? Come the hell on. She gonna take 50 G's and get people to send more, 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 more. And she gonna pocket all that money. And watch see by another six more months, she gonna still be fucking homeless. The kids gonna still be at people's houses scattered all the goddamn around. Because she's a deadbeat. And she's a bum. That's what it is. She's fucking lazy. She's fucking lazy. No way in the world should a woman have four kids. Can't take care of her kids. You know, and now she got to put them at friends' houses. Oh, send Junior over to a fucking Pamela house. We'll send little little Michelle over to fucking Jason house. Did you keep this fucker spread out? What kind of shit that is, you huh? It's a goddamn shame. It's a damn shame. And it's not on Dre fault. It went to Dre, 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 because Dre got money. Dre is his own goddamn man. Dre got his own family. It's up to her to do her damn part. You know what I'm saying? Not because her father got money. If I pay 37 goddamn years of allowance to someone and they ain't doing a goddamn thing, they don't have an apartment for the kids, for my grandchildren, I damn sure will cut her heart on the fuck off. Damn sure. Maybe Dre saying, fuck that motherfucker, put, put a little cash in for the kids and they turn 18 so they can have a good life. Because his daughter, she's a bum bitch. Definitely is. Bum bitch. That's right. Oh, no punk said that shit. She's a bum bitch. She can't take her own kids, but she can open her goddamn legs up, huh? And have these goddamn kids. But look for daddy for some money for support. Get the fuck out of there. Don't give for shit. Send her $50,000. People out there, if y'all want to, send her $50,000. But I bet you that $50,000, 
Ain't gonna do a goddamn thing for it. Cause you've been getting fucking allowance for 37 years. You could take all this allowance times to get a fucking apartment. I'm seeing these bum motherfuckers out there trying to act like um they're not being helped or this and that. She even said she got a $15 an hour job trying to make ends meet. Trying to make ends meet. $15 a fucking hour is not so goddamn bad. You gotta take your punk ass to work, bitch, and take your goddamn kids and find your apartment and leave your goddamn father alone in my fan peace.